Heads, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black walkthrough. Okay, so, in the last episode, we had a, uh, yeah, we kind of had uh, some kind of a BS go on up in the Dragon Spiral Tower. Yeah. Uh, we, 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 we saw Zekrom, right? Or Reshram? No, we saw Zekrom. Holy crud. And captured Zekrom. Holy crap. So he's got himself a red eyes black dragon. Now we gotta go capture ourselves a blue eyes white dragon. Believe it or not, I'm not joking. This, this is like what's going on right now. He's got red eyes, I got blue eyes. So we're gonna have to go to the Relic Castle in the Desert Resort. And uh, that is exactly what we're gonna be doing right now. Let's go right ahead and, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, you know what? Let's go ahead and fly. Where should we go? The closest place to the Desert Resort is right up in Nimbasa City. So that is exactly where we're going to be going right now. Alrighty. Now, if it kind of sounds like I'm a little tired, it's probably because I am. This is episode 40, guys. And right now, I'm kind of doing an all-nighter just to get as many episodes uh, onto, onto this game, or as many episodes as possible, mainly because, yeah. You know what? COVID-19 has taken our lives into a, another twist, social distancing and all that crud, uh, what else has happened, yeah, uh, work, essential workers and all that crud, yeah, so I got plenty of time on my hands and I kind of decided that, you know what, it's best to stock up on videos just in case this whole pandemic ends and uh, I don't have to do any kind of recording on my weekends, I can just, you know, bam, upload them quickly, so... Yeah, the, whatchamacallit, the, the effort, the effort, the, the dedication that I have for this, yeah, pretty big guys, it's very, very big for all of you guys, and I'm doing this for you guys because, of course, um, most of you guys, probably in high school, middle school, elementary school, I don't know, yeah, you guys don't have school, school has uh, ended a little too early, so, yeah, that's probably the only form of entertainment you probably, or one of the uh, forms of entertainment you guys have, so, I'm glad to do that. I'm glad to entertain for uh, for you guys right here. So, you know, it's not no biggie right now. Especially since it's like, what, 3, 3 o'clock in the morning. Yes, guys, I'm not joking. It is 3 o'clock in the morning right now. And I'm currently doing this whole walkthrough. So I'm going to be sleeping pretty well. That's right. I'm going to be sleeping well. Don't worry, guys. I don't have work in the next day because I'm not really essential. <laughs> not something to laugh about. But I'm okay. I'm okay. So here we are in the, uh, the desert resort. Holy crud, man. I'm just messing up my words right now. And all we have to do is go into the relic castle. So hopefully we don't have to battle anybody that I left off. As you can see, that is not the place to go. That is a tower. We're going to have to go back over here. Okay, so first thing is first. If you guys remembered, we got ourselves a Rage of Candy Bar back in Isra City from the kid of the old, the former team uh, Rocket member, the international team Rocket member. Now, these little bastards here love Rage of Candy Bars, and if you feed it to them, they will wake up and they will start attacking you and all that stuff. Now, I do believe these uh, Darumakas actually do have, uh, or not Darumakas, Darmanitans, have a special move with them, so... We'll do that later on. We got to take care of business right here. And of course, we're getting stopped by our good old buddy, Charon. He's like, stop, Draven. Okay. That's the entrance to the Relic Castle. You're impressive, Draven. Making it here before I did. Dealing with the Desert Resort's Pokemon took longer than I have thought. You could use repels. I mean... They only cost like uh, a few pokey dollars, but you know, you buy them in bulk and you can get here quickly. It's not that hard. I only made it out here thanks to my Pokemon. All your way on ahead, let's hurry. Okay, well let's take care of, let's take care of this right here. So we've already battled everybody in here. I believe this is where we got ourselves a fossil. And now I think we are able to go into the next level right here. First First is first. I need to I need to put on a repel because I really don't want to get attacked by any Pokemon right here. So let's go repel. All right. So now you can actually go through here with any problems. And here you're gonna be finding us one of the seven sages. This guy right here. He's like his name is Ryoku. Gets has told us that once again we have to test how you uh, how much power you have. We will see if you can defeat Team Plasma. Okay. So we don't battle him, right? 
Do we? I don't even know. And wow, this there's not much in here. Look at that, not much. So we're gonna have to battle some guy right here. Let's go right ahead and battle him. See what he has to say. I've heard about you. I've heard about uh, you, or I heard you work with Pokemon hard. Well, I'm a strict disciplinarian, but it gets the job done. At the end of the day, we still love each other and all that crud. So here we go, Team Rocket or Team Plasma Ground wants to battle us, and here we go with the Watcha. So I'm gonna come out with this guy right here, the big guns, the big guns, with the revenge. Let's get this revenge. And I don't know, I don't know. Why are you faster than my Pokemon? I don't know. So here it is, revenge. Yes. What now? What now? Okay, and let's see, he's gonna come out with the Crookerock, so let's continue on right here. Let's continue on right here with the waterfall. See, see we can add. See, see if we can uh, defeat him in just one hit. So there we go. Waterfall takes care of that. Yeah, buddy. Look at that, look at that. And Gigalith gets experience points too. He's coming out with another Crookerock, so continue on. Let's get this. Another waterfall right here. Okay, waterfall. Does it do it? Can it do it? Yes, it can. Look at that, Crocorock defeated. Okay, alrighty, alright, alright, and uh, look at that. Yes, I heard you're strong. You match what I heard say exactly. Okay, alrighty. So now we can just run into the hole right here, and it will actually take us to the next level, an unknown level that we haven't been to, and you will be able to find a max uh, max potion right here. Okay, so. Let's see. Let's go right ahead and switch out our Pokemon. Let's go ahead and give it to Drillmonger and see if uh, he can grow a level right here. Now, I'm going to turn on my dowsing machine just in case we find some hidden items right here. And uh, Homie here will see us. What's up? You. To please my Pokemon, lose. Okay. <laughs> kind of scary. Okay, so here we go. Going up against another Team Plasma Grunt, and he is coming out with a Scraggy. And I'm coming out with a Drillmonger. About to destroy you. The blink of an eye. Let's go with an Earthquake. Yeah, buddy. Earthquake attack. Does it do it? Can it do it? Yes, it does. Suck it, Scraggy. Alrighty. Okay, alrighty. And let's see. He's going to be coming out with a Watchog, so let's go ahead and switch out. Let's go with Shatter right here. Shatter the Cheddar. Let's get this. Shatter the Cheddar gets it. Mohawk Pokemon ready to grow to another level right here. And Watchog, the official Pokemon of Team Plasma right here. So here we go. I jump kick. And that's the end of that for Watchog. Ready. So I guess your Pokemon are not pleased at all. He's like, what a trainer. Okay, so... Is there anything else that we could find right here? No, we're going to be finding more Team Plasma members, so let's go right ahead and battle them all. I really don't care. Lexi, you can't change the world without a little a little pain. That is true. Sometimes you got to suffer to make it to this world right here, so... Let's go right ahead. Another Team Plasma Grunt? Let's see what she's got. She's got herself a Garbodor. Or, or, yeah, Garbodor. Yeah, Garbodor. Yeah. I got the move for you. So glad to see you. So so sad to see you go. Here we go, earthquake attack. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. <laughs> okay, so she doesn't like pain at all. Okay, so let's uh, go right ahead and crap. That's one thing. You can't be running around these uh, sinkhole areas because they will sink you. And, well, here we are, and let's see, does this take me anywhere? Crud, okay, so I'm gonna have to wait for, I'm gonna have to wait for that item right there. So here we go, battling another Team Plasma member, and uh, if everyone frees their Pokemon, there is no winning or losing. All right, let's see. Let us see what's going on right now. Team Plasma Grunt wants to battle, and coming out with the Crookerook. I have yet to meet a Pokemon, or trainer, or Team Plasma member with the fully evolved form of Crooked Dial, or Crooked something, uh, something, something Dial or something, I don't even know, here we go, Earthquake Attack, 
It is 3 o'clock in the goddamn morning, guys. That is dedication. Uh, that is why I'm forgetting a lot of a lot of games or a lot of Pokemon right here. That or I'm probably getting old. I don't know. Look at that. Ace grows level 42. It is learning reversal. Let's see. What does this do again? An all-out attack that becomes more powerful with the less HP. Okay, so that right there I'm not going to use because... Yeah, I already, I already, I already have it clear. I already know what kind of moves I wanted to have. So there we go. Defeated this guy. And let's see. Let's go ahead and grab this item. We found ourselves a max revive. And... Crud. Okay, so we can't go right there. Let's go right ahead and uh, figure stuff out right here. I think I see another item right there. Nope, we can see a Pokemon trainer. All right, honey, what do you have to say to me? Pokemon are too good uh, for the likes of you. They are amazing, but putting them in the hands of a foolish trainer can bring nothing good. So why do you have Pokemon? I just want to know. I mean, my Pokemon are doing well, right? I don't know. Okay, here we go, another Team Plasma Grunt, one in a battle that's coming with Knifeard. Let's get this. Let's get this, okay. Drewmonger. Yeah, Earthquake. <laughs> earthquake attack. Okay. Let's see. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna be flinching, so let's go with an Earthquake attack, and uh, there we go. Earthquake attack does it. Alrighty, okay. Alright, Gigalift grows to level 42. You gotta love those experience shares that I have, and he's coming out with, or she's coming out with a true bitch, so let's just continue on right here. Going with an earthquake attack, see what we can do. Earthquake. Yeah, buddy. There we go. And uh, let's see. Well, it's coming out with another true bitch, so let's go ahead and just complete this whole thing. Drillmonger needs to grow to level 41. Let's get it. Another Earthquake attack. And that takes care of that right there. Now let's see if we get to level 41. Yes, it does. Okay, level 41. Way to see you. And that takes care of that team, uh, Plasma Grunt. Now we have to get to the next floor. Before that, we should get this. And here we have another PP up, the Pokemon Viagra. And we're gonna be running through here, see where we where we can go. Alrighty. Oh crud, okay, so we got a double battle ready for us. And there's an item close by here, so let's see. Who okay, so let's go with this guy and Drillmonger. Let's destroy these guys. Okay. Let's oh wait, it's a single battle. We fight for the young king, that's it! Right, okay. Let's go. We're going up against another Team gr uh, Team Plasma Grunt. I'm always seeing Team Galactic and stuff. Didn't I have that problem going into Team uh, or into Pokemon Platinum? Do not know. Alrighty, so is there anything I need to talk about besides from commentating this stuff? Yes. Okay, so we're getting very, very close to finishing this walkthrough, guys. I'm, I'm noticing that right there. And like I said in the last episode, um, I'm hoping to be done with this walkthrough by May, by the end of May. You know, the whole thing, the whole shebang, uh, in-game and out of game and all that crud. And going into Pokemon X, which will be the next walkthrough, the main, main series walkthrough that I'm going through. And, jeez. I was also saying this about my hat games, or any extra games that I may have had. And if this thing continues till like, I don't know, the summer, or shoot, I'm hoping it doesn't get past May. I'm hoping it ends at May right here. But if you guys have any suggestions for any other Pokemon games that I should feature right here onto this uh, to this channel, please go ahead, comment down below, guys. If you have any suggestions from any hack games that I haven't heard of or anything like that, by all means, you got the floor right there, you know. Let me know, man. Oh, crud. The item's right there, so let's go ahead and battle this guy right here. Okay. It's a lady right here. I won't tolerate people who have different ideas. It's, it it, it kind of sounds familiar. kind of sounds like today's day and age and all that crud. But I won't get into that. So here we go. Trubish wants the battle. And I got myself my Drillmonger because he's awesome like that. 
Now, let's see. What's, other, what's another game that I've never played that I'm interested in? Now, the Pokemon Ranger games, the, the Game Boy Advance games, those I kind of have a slight interest in because... I, I, well, I, I kind of have a slight interest. I've watched a walkthrough here and there. But I don't know if I kind of want to feature it right here on my, my channel. Hack games that I may have maybe interested in. Pokemon Brown. You know, that's another game that I, I've, I've been seeing. Like, I've been seeing and all that stuff. I do have a copy of it on my uh, computer and all that stuff. So, yeah. I, 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 that may be one. What else? What else? I, I also saw, I also read somewhere Pokemon Light Platinum. Now, if someone can explain that for me, Light Platinum, comment down below. Kind of want to know a little bit more about that game. Now, let's see. We're going to go right here. I know I'm, ma I'm probably making a mistake, but this is all this is all to get the last item that we, we didn't get on the other room. So, let's go right ahead and grab this. Found ourselves a Sunstone. Nice. And, let's see. We're going to go upstairs. And, okay, so we're going to have to start this all over again, I think. Which is no problem, because we still need to get, grab one more item. So right here, and... Okay, so that's the area that we didn't go to. And we don't want to... Crud, hold on. I was about to say, I don't want to battle a Pokemon, but I completely forgot about my dowsing machine. And here we'll find a Krookerok. A Krookerok or whatever. Sorry if I'm butchering the names. I know how many of you guys don't like uh, the names being butchered and all that crud. Alright, let's get this out, and let's go ahead and use a Max Repel again. Alright, let's grab this, and here we found TM30 Shadow Ball. So the most important Pokeball that I forgot was right here all along. Who can learn Shadow Ball? I want to know a way if I needed to use it. Let's see, we got quite a few... Actually, hold on. Hold the... God dang it. Hold on. Alright, so we got Frost Breath. I want to see who can learn that. Could use that at some point. And nobody on my team can learn it. Kind of surprising. So let's see who can learn Shadow Ball right here. Okay, here we go. Shadow Ball. I have an idea who can learn it. And it's... Wow. Ace and Gigalift. Okay. Alrighty, so I kind of have an idea who I want to teach it to, so let's just go straight into this pit right here. And finish off our little adventure. At this point, I really don't care where we're at. So we're going right here. And... Okay, so I messed up. Shouldn't have gone right there, so let's go right up here again. Alright, back up, back up, and... Crud. Wrong way. Wait, wait, wait. Right way. Okay, so here we are. Drive, go down here. And then we're gonna have to go... We're gonna have to get away from this pit right here. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, so we're balancing. So, wherever a Team Plasma member is at, then that's probably the, the area where you need to go. So here we are, looking at running into these pits. And here we are at the bottom, and look at that. Super Saiyan, Super Saiyan Akuma is battling Getsis, and Charon's like, whew, I finally caught up. Man, you are always late. You two, come here. Come to my side. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh, here comes the music. It looks like everyone is here. It seems you are working hard to resurrect Reshiram, the other Dragon-type Pokemon, aren't you? But it appears the lightstone you seek is not here. Well then, congratulations are in order. Draven, you are chosen by our king. If you truly desire to keep the world as it is, where Pokemon live alongside people, you must bring the other uh, dragon type Pokemon, uh, the other dragon type Pokemon spoken of in legend, and in battle with our king. Otherwise, Team Plasma will steal every Pokemon from every person in the world and release them all. Oh damn. Release them, you say? Do the Pokemon live with their uh, trainers actually want that? Is the liberation you talk about really just stealing Pokemon from people? What's this? Champion Alder, even though illness took the Pokemon that 
had been a, a, your partner uh, for many years and you haven't had a serious battle in, a, in all of that time, even you, who ordered the Elite Four to protect the Pokemon League and left to wander the Unova region alone. Even a champion like you wants to protect the, po uh, the world where Pokemon and people live together? Team Plasma's King will show the people of Unova that he is stronger than a champion who keeps Pokemon, or uh, keeps Pokemon bound. And just like the hero who, who founded Unova, he will be accompanied by the legendary Pokemon. He will give this order, trainers, release your Pokemon. For this, we have prepared a suitable castle for the legendary Zekrom and our king. I won't lose. I'll fight for all the, uh, the trainers who love their Pokemon and for all the, uh, the Pokemon who believe in their trainers. Our king has no interest in you. He has already determined a vic or determined victory against you and, and is assured. Hmm. So you stayed behind just to tell me that? Just to make a fool of me? Of course not. I'm doing this out of kindness. Yes, kindness. I'm making sure the champion doesn't get hurt for no reason. Granted, the moment when someone loses all hope. I really do love to watch that moment. Well then, farewell. Oh damn. Oh damn. Scary motherfucker. Oh damn. Elder, what are you gonna do now? Hmm. It seems the only to only or it it seems my only choice is to return to the Pokemon League and battle N. But it bothers me to do exactly what gets us want. More importantly, what should we do about the Lightstone? Elder's like or yeah, Sharon's like, Elder, why don't you go outside for now? Yes. That's a good idea. It's hard to breathe in here. Okay, I, I kind of wanted to stay here because there's a Pokemon that I... Oh, never mind. Okay, fine. Screw me, right? I'm just a quiet one. Never mind. It's hard to put into words, but I'll never forgive them for this. What could you... Uh, what could that guy and possibly want? Could he be trying to prove he is right by winning a battle of uh, two dragons? Oh, damn, man. We're getting a call. I hope it's my mama. Okay, who's calling me? Well, it's the professor, Draven. Draven! Hello, Draven? Oh, you picked up. Hey, Draven. Come on to the museum at Nacreen City immediately, right away. Got it? I mean, right now. Oh, damn, she is scared. She is scared. Okay. I could hear Professor Juniper's voice from uh, clear over here. Seems like something big is happening. I wonder what could, uh, what is awaiting at the museum in Nacreen City. I'll go on ahead. Okay, so he's flying and looking at Akuma leaving us right here. Okay, and Sharon is like, I'll look around the, I'll look around here once more. I don't want to believe what gets us uh, or what that gets us says. You should head over to the Nacre City Museum. Sure, why not? And since we got enough time, let's go right ahead and uh, check what's going on right here. We don't want to make it an extra episode right here, right? I don't think so. So let's fly over to Nat Green City. Hold on. Come on. God dang it. There we go. Got to press hard onto that button right there. So here we go. Flying all the way to Nat Green City. And here we are. Back in the place that we kind of struggled just a little bit. Okay, so something's going on in Nat Green City. And, uh, well, there they are. Alder told me what's going on. Draven, you got caught up in something serious, it seems. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Lenora's here. What's up, girl? Is this it? Oh, whoa. Isn't that the, the stone found in the desert resort? Yes, that's right. But it... But is this really a dragon-type Pokemon? Surely, when I investigated Dragon Spiral Tower, I found the elements... Or I found elements that were dated to be... Or to the same era as the this Lightstone. Juniper, or which which Professor Juniper? Okay, that Professor Juniper. I looked into that. Impressive, as always. But you know we're lucky, cause what if Team Plasma like noticed uh, that old stone at that time? That's a good point. It's clear to me that they uh, they were trying to steal they were trying to steal the Dragon Skull so they could uh, revive the legendary Pokemon or Dragon type Pokemon. If you would, Draven, take this. Wait a moment, Draven. Oh damn, Akuma's mad at me. If you take this Lightstone, that means that you'll 
you'll uh, you'll be the one to battle in if anything happens to me are you like are you really okay with that yep I'm okay I'm not scared I really am not scared I understand you are determined to take on uh, take on this duty then here it is prepare yourself be strong Lenore is like I see if things don't go as planned you'll use this lightstone You'll protect the true future for us and Pokemon. Draven, we're counting on you. Please take care of yourself. Okay, alrighty, and here it is, the Lightstone. Look at that. Okay, so that's a that's an important key item right there. Cedric's like. So, how do we wake the Dragon type Pokemon from uh, the stone then? Huh? Hmm? Dot dot dot. Okay. What, 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 okay. Well, how do we wake them up? That's it. We got them, don't we? Uh-huh, we got those too. Draven, go to Opalescent City. The leader of that city uses Dragon-type Pokemon. The gym leader would know, uh, or could know something. I'll go ahead and wait for you there. Until then. So there goes Akuma again. He kind of looks like Akuma from Street Fighter. He really does. Coolest Street Fighter character ever, by the way. That's right. Opalescent City Draven might know something. Hey Draven, never forget what. Uh, never forget that you always have Pokemon right by your side. I'm going to head back to the lab to do some research. I'll see if I can uncover what kinds of beings these, these legendary Dragon type Pokemon are in. If they are in any way to awaken them. Okay, that was kind of some choppy reading right there, but it's okay. It's whatever. Okay, Lenora's like, don't worry. If we have something for you, we'll come running to find you. Bianca's like, oh, sounds real serious. Um, that's about all I could, uh, got out of it. <laughs> Draven, do you know, do you know Opalescent City? When you leave from Mr. City and, like, cross the tube line bridge, it's, like, on the other side. Um, I'm not great at directions, so if you need more, check your town map, okay? Well, okay, well, we'll look at the town map and whatever. Okay, so that has been this episode, guys. I'm about to go to bed. But I hope you enjoy this episode right here. You know, it's all there for you guys. So in the next episode, we're going to be going to Op Op Opalescent City and taking care of business over there. And then hopefully finishing up this walkthrough once and for all and all that stuff. That won't be until later, way, way, way later on. So thank you guys again. I'll see you guys next time.